I made it here. Yes. Cool. Uh, excellent. You strung like bull. Right. And so you cut it and then you swim back. Don't need to roll. You swim back. And right, Alex, give me a strength roll. This is pulling her gently but firmly into the boat because getting into this oh. fucking boat. It just fucking grabs your belt and now you're in the boat. You don't know what happened. You don't remember any intervening space between the water and the boat. Cool. Just, he's strong like a bull. Probably from fucking all the lionesses. <laughs> it has made him super tough. So um, what? this is what men are like all over the world, too, because you know, you know it would immediately come to mind. Does she go? Mm. Yeah. And she I'm went. <laughs> so right um okay now you uh then move the boat to uh the the next place mm -hmm. and let's see if the guy notices that he is very slowly floating away Actually. yeah <laughs> just as imposing and everything else now to roll for everybody else do you notice your buddy is floating away yeah <laughs> And you guys are just sitting there going, oh, they can't, that's not right. And the guy's getting smaller and smaller <laughs> in the distance. And you're just sitting there, you're looking at the remaining five or whatever uh, barges going, I think we've got to do it again. Nobody fucking noticed. Like, what? Hey, hey, what's going on? Oh, good. Give me a, a mimicry roll. Uh, this will actually throw your voice. You know what? I actually have Wow. That's your big mimicry no. fucking. You know. <sighs> Can't believe I'm not using the bloody going away. Yeah. Uh, the guards all try again since. Somebody's except for the one that's floated off. Obviously, he's not fucking <laughs> finding anything. But the, to get the night where all the bloody guards are asleep. Oh, now <laughs> they notice. Oh, oh, look, <laughs> Phil is going away. Hey, Phil, you're fucking going away. No, I'm not. Phil, you are. <laughs> you're getting, you're getting smart. Maybe you're just short. No, Phil, that's not the way it works. So there's there's a lot of excitement. And uh, the guards are now like getting in their little boats to go and try to get him and shit. They're leaving a skeleton crew, but there is still a skeleton crew. Shouldn't be a real problem uh, to get your boat up and stuff, but you are going to have to both be sneaky. Mm. At full, but you got to okay. be, you got to make it at full. Sneaky. Great. Ninja. <laughs> he disappears off the boat next to the cannon, motions toward you. Come, come over here. His mouth isn't matching up with the words coming out either. He's like, come over here. I didn't made it by van. You missed your stealth roll? By van. No problem. You hear a guard go, what was that? What? What? I paused it. I paused it. it. Oh, come on, Yana. Just you fail dramatically it. and blow it. Fucking hell. What was that? What? what was that? Don't worry. He hasn't seen Alex. Just you and the boat. <laughs> or maybe. I got to roll a spot hidden. He may not see it. If he's anything like the dude who's still going and in <laughs> denial, you'll be fine. If I roll over a 70, you're fine. Mm. Oh. You! Stop! In the name of the king! <laughs> You hate your life so much, you think. So, well, Alex, guard's coming over. He's going to, since you got a crit, your crit on stealth is you are now behind the dude who goes, What are you doing? And we what? go into standard combat as I suspect fuckery is afoot. He's got a rifle yeah, and stuff. Quick. Yeah, it's going to be tough because he's got a gun. Jamie's got a gun. And so is this guy. And we go into your, let's see. Uh, it's one fucker. If you can't handle one fucker, you're fucked. So heroes are first. Villains can only defend themselves. Reloading is approved. 
So if Yana calmly pulls out her pistol and starts loading new bullets, then she'll get a card. But otherwise, yeah. All right, quick throw sword. Okay. Uh, Yana, what are you doing? The guard's looking at you expectantly like he's chosen, like, move, and the sword flies by him. He's like, hmm? Um, I... Ah! Uh, I suppose that if I fire a gun, everybody would know that something's up. Oh my god, yes. They're, the guards aren't that far away. They're yeah, just out okay. of torch range, that's all. So I just punch him? Uh, you're in a boat. Oh, okay. I'm not you're, you, you, you were trying to like get closer and stuff? Now, if you want to, you can maneuver up on the dock, like dramatically going really? from the boat. It, it, of course, it's not stealthy at all. Okay. Yeah. But you're thinking, oh, it needs your help. So when I stand in my own simple action, I place my hand, I try and um, muffle his calls. Mm. He's sort of behind him. So mm -hmm. I stand in the stomach and basically try and... Yana? Um, I didn't maneuver. She belly flops out of the boat <laughs> into the water. <laughs> She throws her pistol on the seat of the boat, and she's like, ha And you're like, she was really <laughs> She was good at swimming, you think? You're not sure what happened here. All right, and uh, the guy for his action, uh, if he rolls under 30, he does the only smart thing he could. Otherwise, he just struggles like a useless tit. Now he struggles like a useless tit rather than firing his gun. Yeah. So we now go, I saw Matt's look like, oh God, is he going to figure it out? No, no, it was close. Mm -hmm. It's the possible last round of combat. Heroes are first. Yana thinks she, uh, she's a shark. Any action is approved. So Yana, if you want to make a swimming roll, you can get a card from swimming. Don't forget you guys each have a card pool. Uh, mm -hmm. And heroes are first. Uh, so, uh, of, um, Nine? Nine? Yeah, he's grievously wounded. Yana, meanwhile, decides she's had enough of this shit. <laughs> she fucking, uh, she, she drops her skinning knife into the, the, the no. darkness and no. begins swimming after it and no. drowning herself. She'll eventually die, but for now, she's dropped her skinning knife and is desperately swimming straight down for it. No. Um, I pause it. Are you sure? It's just a skinning knife, Yana. It's I mean... important to me. <laughs> it's my most important position. Uh, dropping a skinning knife is not a bad thing. <laughs> no, it's the worst. I made it. <laughs> <laughs> I made my skin <laughs> swimming. You need to get her like eight or ten skinning knives and shit. <laughs> them all over the place for her. Because never mind, mean... she will fucking spend all of her hero points Did trying to... Re <laughs> All right, for his round, the guy is going to try to uh, basically wallop uh, uh, Alex so that he can, you know, uh, and he uh, actually he wants to he wants to reverse grapple uh, so that he is no longer being touched by you so he can yell for help because he thinks he's going to fucking die. So he is going for a grapple roll. He's not great at it, but. No, he's not that good at it. He struggles in your grasp, hoping you don't kill him next round. He's going to die. He's on fire. He's had a fall and stuff. He's had a fall and stuff. All right. And don't forget your card uh, if you did something successful uh, that round. Oh, yeah. Yana, yeah. who made her yeah. fucking and not dying roll. Oh, my God. Now, keep in mind, I did say it's standard combat. Villains are first. And unfortunately for you guys, get reinforcements. God, a round revision would have been key right now, Yana. If only you hadn't gotten rid of the round revision card. But as it is, a couple of our guys go, stop in the name of the king. <laughs> You're, it's, it's rapidly going to shit. They're on a different barge and pointing rifles and shit. You're thinking, even if they miss, the alarm's out. The mission's probably a bust. Fortunately, most of the forces are currently in pursuit of a raft, which is caught in a fucking dangerous riptide going out to sea, and they're paddling after it in their boat. But if they hear gunfire, they'll probably be paddling back. 
So it's looking like this mission is going to shit. So the villains go, they yell, stop in the name of the gang. What up, y'all? And fortunately, they don't see Yana. She's fucking underwater because her fucking knife, and she's got it, and it just shows bubbles going, my precious, my precious. <laughs> That's from a movie, Yana. And I know. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, right. They wait to see if you move, and they shoot. Oh, the guy you're struggling against, he is not stopping. Oh, he's not first? Oh, yeah, villains are first. All right, right. And he attempts to uh, club you into submission with the butt of his rifle. Aha! He says, I knew that he pitches himself off and into now he is trapped in the same ocean as a vengeful Yana is with a fucking skinning knife. I don't follow anything about it. All right. Give me a uh, jump roll if you'd like to do one of those cool ass dives, or you can just flop off of the thing for free. I quit. Wow, he goes, Hoop! and he does like a fucking uh, back flip and yeah. goes in the ocean. <laughs> and the guards are like, damn it! <laughs> <laughs> they shooting, they shooting. Uh, right, now we're going into longer rounds because shit be happening. Uh, villains are first and have a cybernetic overload. <laughs> Philosophizing on the nature of life as you're both underwater is approved, but not practical. Uh, the, right, the guard for his action attempts to swim. He would not like to be in the water. Right, he has dropped his rifle and desperately begins chasing it down. <laughs> I think that if left to his own devices, he should self-destruct nicely. I knew he should have poisoned <laughs> You've never seen a plan go to f shit so fast. Yeah. The beauty of the round revision card. Mm. All right, I got some swim roll, and I'm attempting just to swim for sure. All right, and so, Yana? Me too. It's taking your boat, which was never your boat. You never. Uh, of course, I fumbled my. Yana drops her skidding <laughs> leg. No, no. I chose a fucking crab. No. Off to get it. No. no. All right, sticking with the roll. I right. pause it. Pause what? it. Pause it. No, it's just a, it's a three dollar or two dollar skinning knife. I made my <laughs> I love oh my, my skinning knife. Oh my god. The crab is so disappointed because it's going to use that fucking knife on that other crab. <laughs> so, right, you managed to fucking swim your ass toward uh, shore. Both of you guys give me a stealth roll and you're out of this and hopefully on to something else. But Yana will blow her stealth roll. The fucking crab will come after I made fucking... it. Oh, man. I was going to have the crab fucking reeking its vengeance. <laughs> Holy shit. Uh... They are really riled up at the fucking barges. The air guys, some of them, a couple of them were trying to get their barge back. The rest were coming back with rifles and, ah, da, 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 and there's a lot of yelling and shit. Who did? Who did? He's dark. He's dark. Where? What happened to our guy? He drowned himself. We don't know why. He's very depressed. <laughs> but he had a couple bullet holes or a couple slices probably from fish hooks, you know, that kind of shit. So, yeah. Yeah. Back then, they didn't really do a lot in forensics, so could have been the crabs. Mm. Crab almost got your fucking skinning knife, Yana. No, it's my knife. That'd be awesome. She goes into the fucking uh, seafood restaurant, and she looks in there and goes, I want that crab. And the crab's like, fuck you, I will have my vengeance. <laughs> Maybe that's when the insanity. Yeah. <laughs> Hatred of crabs. <laughs> I could I could see if her must always have a skinning knife and then yeah. like at times takes it out. Must mm. always have a skinning knife and must always uh treat aggressively against sea creatures of any time. treats a skinning knife like a uh, uh, golem does the one ring. Yeah. <laughs> that's creepy as fuck too. That's that's it the added the bonus. Pods, so I think that's definitely detrimental. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, oh yeah. I have no, no. Are you sure you want problem. to take this in? Because you do realize now every time you fumble, you're going to be like, this is so <laughs> 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 
Well, it's better than just having her dress drowned and shit, you know. Mm -hmm. I didn't know she'd spend fucking paws on it, but hey, you know. Yeah. I think I will I will get to always wants her skinning knife. I like that. Yeah. Uh, 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 not just wants it compulsively. Yeah, like has to have it. Mm -hmm. style. Yeah. Style. <laughs> I think it's funny that we didn't pause the stealth for all that brood mission, but I paused the losing skinning knife two times. Cool. So, um, hey, hey, uh, you guys are back on shore. You're wet, cold, and scared. Yay. Yay. Right, looks like we're just going to go back to the hidden. Okay, some other stupid bastard. Mm. Or, or we can, or, or, and I might get into trouble. <laughs> What? Um, yeah, there's cannons up at the castle. <laughs> there are cannons up at the castle. Down to this area. I was thinking about that. But they're hard to control. You have access to that area. Plus, I really yeah. don't want to get in bad with the war family. <laughs> <laughs> Just the one monkey dude. Yeah. Well, surely we can set up a good poison. Yeah. Let's do, let's do this intelligently. Like we should have first time. Let's I do have... research on the guy. Let's find out if there's any particular food or drink he really favours. Yeah. Uh, maybe let's see if he's got any particular you know, admirers or maybe a, a girlfriend or something. Find out her name. Send him a parcel. Oh, I let my girlfriend send me my favourite cookies or whatever. Poison. <laughs> Dead. Cool. Yeah. Look yeah, I have botany, so I can figure out what is poisonous. Ah, yes, we do have a chemist. Yeah. Good point. Okay, make it sound. Right, so you guys basically want to observe him for a while and uh, see what his habits of, are? Or? Yeah, a bit of like observation, a bit of like, I don't know, um, maybe see what the, like, the pubs he frequents or any of the like, restaurants or something. He goes to that fucking horrible stand-up pub, the uh, the Red Moon or whatever. Yeah, he goes there. Oh, yeah, yeah, because yeah. It, it's Red Moon Tavern. It's shitty. It's cheap. It's horrible. Just like him. Um, as far as food, he just buys stuff. They have like little stands here and there in the docks area. Pretty much seems to live off that. He's not in great shape. He doesn't like people. People don't like him. Aw, I like him. She, well, she likes him because he's pretty fat, and that means he has a lot of extra skin. That's why she fucking likes him. But oh, can we skin don't. him? I mean, he's kind of a monkey. You can literally, like, wait until he comes out of the pub and then just, like, follow him back. Mm. Dark alley. Yeah. I would do it like that because it's simple. He's probably gonna. He'll probably have to try and call. He'll probably call out. So. Yeah. Um, plus, it's it, he does. He doesn't because he doesn't like people and people don't like him. He kind of avoids like really lonely streets and shit because he's thinking somebody will fucking kill his ass because he's an mm -hmm. unpleasant fucker and lots of people are thinking. You know, sooner or later, somebody's going to kill your ass. In fact, somebody even tells him that while you guys are watching. Sooner or later, somebody's going to kill you. He's like, ah, fuck you. I don't like anybody. But I'm not walking home down the dark alley. And they're like, God damn it. <laughs> Fucking monkey. <laughs> so, yeah. Hmm. Okay. Um. I... Mm -hmm. He must be very lonely. Oh my. Ooh. Another <laughs> inner inner species thing going on here. Maybe. Oh my. I uh, could you're not sure if this is a guy that could be seduced or that 
anybody rational would want to seduce. It's kind of up to you, but it's pretty horrible. Yeah. Give it a go. Like a I, <laughs> I thought you'd be the one wanting to fucking uh, seduce some magic. <laughs> I could just try it and uh, then uh, kill him and not do anything with him. Hmm. I also have psychology, so I could like use psychology to manipulate him to like me or something. Actually, give me a psychology roll after. Oh, first, give me surveillance rolls. Uh, one of you, the air can support. I just need one good surveillance roll to observe him for the day. Because you guys are Australians. This is a lot harder to fucking spy on somebody and shit because, you know, it, it, it'd be like going to the all-white, it'd be like being in Burlington, the all-white neighborhood, and having two black guys spy on you all day. Mm. They stick out. Yeah. Okay. How good are you at surveillance? I'm not good at all. Okay, you, you, um, you uh, trying to help me. Okay. Go, Yana. Woo, get that check. Woo. No. If she rolled a fucking fumble, I'd be like, you drop your skin, I doubt it, got her. Just about <laughs> her. I wouldn't even dare have that be the result. I was just going to fuck with her on that. It's like, yeah, you know, we're all too daisy. I'm sure it's easy to get to. She's like, <laughs> <laughs> all right, great. Yeah, you guys end up losing him in the crowd and stuff for a while because, you know, you didn't want to get seen. There's a choice between getting seen or so you went with the you know, lesser of two evils. Hmm. Um, okay. Well, yeah. So he's much too wily for the likes of you, pale faces. Uh, or, uh, like, he could try to do, give him something into his drink in the pub. Yeah, I'm trouble. I'm guessing this guy's going to be tough to do that way because he seems to be very <laughs> paranoid of everyone. Yeah. Um, well, I suppose it's some. It's a fat monkey at the end of the day. Yeah. But I suppose at some point when he's at the pub, if he's on his own, at some point he has to go to the toilet. Or does he didn't take a drink with him. Or... No, he knocks it, knocks it all back, yeah. and then goes outside, pees on the side of the bar. Right there where everybody can see him, comes back in. Yeah. <laughs> if there's a bum laying there, probably get peed on. Mm. Okay. Mm. Can I do psychology roll? Uh, you didn't really make your surveillance roll, so you didn't oh. weren't able to get enough information on him. You eventually caught up with him at the pub because everybody goes around the pub. As they say in England. Yeah. Um, is there any particularly um, really like nasty looking? I mean, obviously it's a it's a it's a place that's a really sharehold. But is there any particular like one guy who stands out who maybe seems to be a bit of a bit of a bully, a bit of a you know hot wire? There he is. Yeah. Cool. What does he look like? Big, scarred, nasty-looking, alligator-headed dude missing some of his teeth, although there's a bird sitting on his head. It's a little bird. Occasionally, it goes and cleans his teeth and says, oh, how's this? You know, and all that, like it's a hairdresser, but it's doing his teeth. Mm -hmm. <laughs> She's like, this is insane. <laughs> um, but yeah, he, he's he's the guy. Um, yeah. He's got uh, uh, two parrots on each shoulder, and he's dressed as a pirate. He's dressed as a pirate. Cool. Mm -hmm. um, I go to the bar, and I order the most feminine drink I could find on the menu. Whiskey or beer, says the bartender, confused by effeminate. <laughs> <laughs> this is the guy place. They've got two taps. Two. Um, I go to the boss and I say, what's the, uh, I don't whiskey, but I'll say, right. what's the, uh, what's the gentleman's name there? I point out the really nasty looking one. Captain Crawl. Oh. Yes, him. The guy, he, he, he gave a guy a choice between being 
uh, captured or biting his leg off. Yeah. yeah. He once made a man eat his own buttocks. Yeah. Mm. Is it? Took a while. Okay. One time he made an uh, enemy uh, uh, captain, I heard, eat his own lips. <laughs> yeah. That's pretty good. That's oh, yeah. Pretty good. He's nobody you want to mess with. Oh, no. No, I didn't. I didn't uh, uh, I do you want your other three whiskeys? Oh, yeah, sure. That'll be a dollar. He puts down four whiskeys for a dollar. <laughs> <laughs> they have an easy system here. You get four whiskeys at once. This is not a place to hang out. This is a place to go in, fucking drill down some shots, and go somewhere better, or fucking go pee in the uh, street. Mm -hmm. Either way, it's good. Mm -hmm. All right. It shows. It shows. It shows like a couple of ladies like doing the awkward lady peeing in the streets. Like, ah, yeah. <laughs> This is harder for us, you <laughs> bastards. And the guys are like, eh, eh, eh. I'm drunk. I go to Captain Crow. He glares at you with his uh, non all white eye. One of them is like all white, like cataracts or roomy, or somebody poked it out with a stick or something. And the other one looks at you and he goes, ah, oh, eh. Captain Crow? Maybe. Who's asking? Who is asking? Say the parrots. Oh, no. There's just, um, there's, there's a fat monkey guy over there, and he's said some really bad things about you. Ah, that'd be Marion. What's yeah. his name? The, yeah. He's a fucking horrible cunt, and I hate him. He was saying some really nasty things about your mother. <laughs> oh, I mean, some of the words he's coming out. Something about she likes a pleasure, like, Sailors around the back of the pub. Oh, is she out there? <laughs> <laughs> he gets up and goes, Bob, Bob, I'm here. Uh, good flood. <laughs> Eventually, he comes back and goes, My mother wasn't back there. Oh, maybe she finished up her shift for the evening. Well, actually, he shrugs and says, that, that was nothing to what you were saying about your what? what? <laughs> Says one of the parrots. Shut up, yo, I'm just, talking. He just said in the whole time he was doing his job at the docks, he's never seen such a bad captain before. Right? Excuse me. I wouldn't know that kind of thing like. Oh, he, he's already moving. By the time you're like, I wouldn't, he's already fucking yeah. heading out, like under under full set. His, yeah, his mother is a whore, <laughs> and he's good with that. <laughs> His, his, his father is fucking probably blowing midgets for fucking uh, nickels in the back, but you know the, the captaincy though. Oh my! He goes over and he goes, "What you been saying about my being a captain?" And Mary goes, "Let's see his stupidity meter." Really low is really good for him. Really high is really bad. He says, yeah. eh. And he goes, ah! he grabs him and shakes him. <laughs> he, said, he said he sunk your last two ships. <laughs> right. Give me a fast talk at half just to get a generalized bar fight going just from saying that as things spiral. No. God damn. That would have been fucking perfect. <laughs> All right, he shakes the monkey for a while, and the monkey. Let's see if he gets. To, uh, he decides throwing poo is now the right thing to do. <laughs> so let's see on his accuracy. He missed the captain. Both of you guys give me luck rolls. Of oh no! Is to see because okay. Yana always fails her shit. So I want a good laugh. I now, get it. God damn it! Right, he hit some iron dude. Yeah, and now. Let's see, Matt, give me the luck roll. Lower is better for big bar fight. Yeah. A Yay. huge fucking brawl starts in. There are weapons available and stuff. Uh, it looks like pretty much all that's going on with the captain and Marion is Marion's getting a good slapping around. Not really a killing thing, but, you know, the captain doesn't want to kill off the Marion for some reason. Yeah. But there is enough chaos and confusion going yes, on that, exactly. you know. I'm going to accidentally go over and accidentally trip and stop. 
<laughs> That's a big ball for a crow. Sure. Uh, do, you, do you have your sword with you? Yeah, I always have a sword. Oh, I didn't know if you got it back in your magic holdy thing or not. Uh, yeah, I did. One of these days, you could here you could realize you could just put it in a scabbard and not worry about your magic holdy yeah, deal. But I like the magic holdy. Or well, yeah, me too. But I'd I'd probably buy a secondary sword just to make sure you've got one. They sell them here. Yeah. What are you doing, Anna? He's tripping and falling. <laughs> I accidentally go tripping and falling. <laughs> Both of you guys are doing me. Uh, I want to press digitation roll if you if you uh, succeed to make it look totally natural. Otherwise, it look like oopsie da daisy, oopsie daisy. Oh, but only if you succeed. If you if oh. you miss, then you just look incompetent wow. anyway. Okay. I'm very, I'm very not uh, good. I'm thinking, I'm thinking in the mm. in, in a massive brawl, so so much shit going on. It's... Yeah, but they're they like I said, this this town is a good percentage soldiers, and so basically, if you make your prestidigitation, like if you successfully attack and do damage, and then make your prestidigitation roll, then I don't have to roll spots for any of the soldiers. Oh, okay. Machine. So you tap first, then if you oh, okay, I get you. Okay. So well, if you miss, you just look wildly incompetent anyway. Nobody right, cares. Right, yeah. I got my sword roll. Yeah, nobody cares if you fucking uh, are falling around behind them. It's like hey. so. Yana, what do you do? Yeah, I got my two. I. <laughs> I accidentally punched the person. Mm. Yes. Excellent. Uh, so you hit, do your damage, and then try a press the mm -hmm. and make it look natural as opposed to whoopsie daisy. Um, so this round, it's looking like he's taking five points of damage, one from the slapping he's getting, and then two from each of you. Mm -hmm. yeah, he's tough. He can take it. It doesn't look... Uh, right. Excellent. Uh, let's see. Uh, let me do a spot for Marion first. Oh, yeah. Oh. He knows it was you. I know it was you, he says. And for soldiers in general, they know it's you too. So everybody fucking knows Yana is to blame. And unfortunately, she has no more hero points. I just. <laughs> like, I just. Need. I just wanted his laugh, and he refused me. <laughs> no problem. You're going to get plenty of his love with standard saying, combat. The thing is, though, at least mm -hmm. he's just punching. Yes. Yeah. Punching is okay. Punching each other. Oh yeah, the guards aren't getting involved, but the Marion guy, he is getting, he is yeah. going to fucking pop into her a bit. Yeah. So she's now in single combat with a big fat monkey dude. Well, the captain, the captain's there, but if Marion's starting to punch on somebody else, yeah, it, it's you know, um, as far as the the captain goes, though, he's happy to watch this crazy uh, man. He thinks uh, beat up on uh, Marion. In fact, he, he says, "I'll get the drinks." <laughs> So heroes are first, villains can't use cards, being on the water at least six feet deep. Actually, I'll give you guys each a card because the uh, uh, the bar is technically over the water because it's over a built up dock type thing. Mm. It's, you know, that's its location. So each of you get a card just for being here. Uh, Yana, go ahead and give me a beat on uh, Fat Monkey Guy. He's already a bit wounded. He's at five down, but he's really big, really fat, and really angry make martial arts punch go for it do some damage four okay you almost double the amount of damage on he looks really hurt uh matt are you doing anything you're just gonna oh, card horror bit <laughs> oh jesus that 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 will get him meanwhile he uh gives a good beating jesus christ <laughs> Uh, so you critted the uh, press digitation and stuff, yeah? Uh, no, that was the uh, actual um, attack roll. Oh my! Well, it was pretty poor. It was really poor. 
Um, I got my prestigious post. Uh, prestigious. No problem. Matt's not even facing the same direction as this dude. He's like, my sword. Oh my! I seem to have launched it in somebody. Oh, it's my face, Brad. Right? Right? Yep, yep. Oh yeah, he's he's not doing well. Um, he's not really sure. Uh, Yana, you take two real, two stun as you get a good solid hit from Rhino Boy, or sorry, uh, Monkey Boy. Okay. And unfortunately, it was the hand with poop on it. Oh. Yeah, it just gets worse, you think. First the skinning knife, twice, then the fucking crab, now poopy monkey hand. So uh, we now go to what will probably be this poor bastard's last round, uh, although it will take a, probably an extra round to kill him because he had been getting a lot of stun damage and very little reel. Unfortunately for you guys, oh, only in round revision. Oh shit! Heroes are first. I could, have, yeah, both. Not well, sure. I was gonna say, heroes are first. Villain, something good happens. The soldiers are coming over, going, "Come on, man, you've had enough." Oh. So, meanwhile, Yana hits him. When I, when I critted both, what does it mean? Do Jesus. I? Jesus. Um, Double damage. You, there's nothing else cool to it than oh, yeah, but double, but both. Double yeah, both, yeah. Both. Double I'll give you three times damage. Right, roll your roll your damage three times and okay. just put it in. I got no idea. We've never had that happen before. Yeah, right. And you, you know, she's rolling all ones. I think it'll be okay. Right. Wow, shit. <laughs> yeah, that's perfect. That's, so, they okay. give him a good slapping and uh, right. Matt, you're thinking that the guards are going to take him away, even if you stab him, unless you stab him really mightily, because he has absorbed a lot of stun damage, yeah, and mighty stab. It, it, it better be a huge well, got, amount of damage. At least, it's nine, at least nine is real for me. Uh-huh. Right? Uh-huh. I pulled over. He's got a lot of mass, though. You're thinking nine. it's inconceivable. Uh -huh. Oh, that did. He goes, all right, <laughs> and then falls forward into the guard's arms. Uh, do you mind? I got my prestigious patient as well. Do you mind leaving your sword in his back? I'll give you a card if you just leave it stuck out of his back. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> what, what's what doing? <laughs> yeah, the the guards are just taking him away with the sword in his back. They haven't quite noticed it yet. They think he's passed out drunk, and they're like, "Ah, back to bed with you." <laughs> Yeah, I was going to say, they sell them here. Lots of them. I have to pick up a several sword as my fucking main weapon. So, right. Uh, yeah, he's definitely dead and being drug away. Um, <laughs> you run it down. Come on. Give, give me a, uh, uh, a luck roll at half, Matt, for something funny. 86? I have a 92 of luck. Motherfucker. Some guy, uh, for a joke, sticks his hat on the sword <laughs> as they're passing. The cards don't even fucking notice. It's just a fucking bowler cap. They just drag him on off. Come on, man. Time to go back to bed. And they just drag him away. He never really wakes up from it. The cards are like, obvious case of heart attack. So, anyway. <laughs> this, this gentleman suffering from heart disease. Heart disease. Sorry. So yeah, you guys are fine. You uh, uh, wander back to the Australian embassy, or you want to stand here and pound more? Yeah, let's go back to the make sure our whole knows that the job is done. Yeah. Yana, as you're heading out, a strong fucking taloned hand grabs your shoulder, stopping you in your tracks. I look. <laughs> it's a big fucking alligator pirate guy. He thrusts a fucking big cup of whiskey at you. <laughs> You deserve it. He says, Thank you. Nobody talks about my captaincy like that and lives. I did it just for you. Woo! He says, uh, what do I We should that? breed. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what? I'll go get my raping hat, he says. <laughs> he turns his head off. Bye. <laughs> I'm into hey. girls. He, he, yeah, he's, he, he, thinks he, he thinks it's a guy. Um, <laughs> It's true. Yeah, the pirates get really fucking lonely out to sea yeah. for that long, you know? Yeah. Yeah. So he uh, he goes off to get his special hat and uh, shows his wife, hey, why are you wearing your raping hat? Oh, there's nothing. <laughs> nothing. Uh, 
I was just going, oh, she's like, raping? And he's like, oh, dear. <laughs> what did we talk about your hat? And he's like, I know, I know. So anyway, just some other guy I met around the pub. He seemed nice. No, no. <laughs> but they <do>. <laughs> I can see a whole fucking special on this guy. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> he gets his own show. It's a spinoff. <laughs> so, uh, right, you guys head back to the uh, uh, embassy, the Australian embassy. Um, cue uh, uh, National Anthem of Australia playing softly in the background. I don't know it. Mm -hmm. Nobody does. Anyway, uh, so maybe Australians. I don't know. So you guys head over there. It's all dark, as though it's the middle of the night. But upside, there's no guards. And the apparently, the elven kids don't know how door locks work, so you're able to let yourself right in. That's a big bonus. Great. Um, Matt, there's nobody to trip over just inside the doorway tonight. <laughs> big step there, up. There will be later. <laughs> Shows are sleeping in front of the doorway. <laughs> That's like, what the fuck? So, uh, yeah, cut to morning. Uh -huh. Ahoy is delighted. Um, he, he, um, you guys tell him, and then he believes you because he does. And then you realize you could have just told him, and he would probably believe you because he's not very bright. And so he will anyway, but he's very happy you did it. Oh, I would like um, from both of you, uh, give me a small sandy roll for a little thing we like to call cold-blooded killing. Max that shit out. Max it out. Max it out. Yay, cold-blooded killing. One point if you make it. How's Yana doing? No, didn't make it. Yay, D6, I feel better. She says, losing her mind. Roll one, Yana, or... Oh, two. Stay two. Okay. <laughs> so, yeah, Ahoy is fucking delighted. Yeah, kill everybody, he says. It's great. So, yeah. so what about our reward? Yeah. <laughs> of course, he says. I let it never be said that Ahoy will double cross murderous scum. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, right, he is going to attempt to teach you. Ah, oh, there it is. He says, okay. Um, right, he's going to try to teach you. Who wants to go first? Okay. You pick. Shut up. I'll pick uh, the guy with longer hair because, you know. Uh, right. So he attempts to know something about air magic. Mm -hmm. He doesn't. And he attempts to know something about air magic for Matt. He does. Now he's going to try to actually teach. He's not good at this. You're trying to learn your spell from a bird. The bird is not the word. No, he's dumb. So uh, he says, yeah, later, later we'll, we'll work on yes, this more. Yes. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Yeah, of course. I'm happy to. Don't kill me. <laughs> Everything's fine. Don't kill me. Okay. That's uh, three magic you got in the bag at some point. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, I suppose we can quickly, do you want to quickly go back and do uh, the attempt for earth magic for Yana and then fire magic for both of us today? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Let's do our magic rounds. Go for it. Do all your spells and shit. Wait, you're doing the spells. Which, oh, sorry, which spells would you like to... So first off, roll for the goblin to try and teach you. Oh, right. Magic. And then we'll he says, ah, yeah, the dim one. I can teach the dim one. <laughs> yeah, the dim one. No, no. I am all kinds of awesome. Uh, right. First, we're going to do is earth magic. He knows lots about earth magic. Yes. Now we're going to try his teaching. He hates people, so he knows shit about teaching. Here we go. Now. <laughs> and then you want to go visit the lizard? Uh, yeah. 
Let's see. I think the lizard is. As you guys make your rounds, get away from my lizard. Hey, do that thing with your a claw, Danny tells you. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, where's the lizard? Oh. Yeah, you're kind of wishing that you had all these people collected up and, you know. I wish you no, oh, there it is. You're pretty wishing that you made them more confident. <laughs> no, no, they, they 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 got reasonable. First, uh, who's who's learning this one? Oh. All right. First on Yana, does he know what he's talking about? Yes. Now does he can he teach it? <gasps> no. And then on Matt, does he know what he's talking about? Yes. yes. And then can he teach it? No. <laughs> awesome. Awesome. Okay. Pretty much, you know, oh, Yana, decrease your hand back to six, you naughty oh. person. Yes. Um, yeah, pretty much you, you're thinking that if you needed, like, surgery from these guys, you may as well stick your gun in your own mouth and go to town. Not good. Yeah. So, what do we actually have to Well, I suppose we could try and foil the big plot. Well, let me see what's going on today with that, because uh, the... Big boat go bye bye. Uh, first, I need to check before I go into uh, this because once we get into this, it gets a bit more involved. Um, what's going to happen is, hold on, let me check and see how far along you're on it first before I go crazy here. Well, no. What what would happen is if if we went into it, like uh, if you guys because. It's about seven now. I'm happy to keep gaming, but I don't know what your guys' schedule is or how much you want to keep gaming. But it would be end of mission, and then uh, the big attack is prestige mod. So yeah. it's you know. I'm happy doing it that way because I don't want to start something now and have it go so late. But yeah, okay. Then then we'll want to just go ahead and end it for the the it's evening hard. then. So we've done the setup and we've just got the yeah. yeah. Mm. Plus, I've got loads of good cards for in the game. I don't want to lose them. No worries. Um, greedy, greedy. I like it. Yep. Well, you might be the first person to get the thing. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, you guys do a successful mission. The uh, getting into, uh, the killing the guy. Uh, I can't think of any good guy shit that you did because we did a lot of good guy shit. Well, I was gonna say like, well, the the one dude with the rhino thing failed to save him. The, the you went and assassinated somebody for a vengeful we, fucking cockatoo. We, yeah. we saved the the Albert boy. Okay, yeah. okay, you did do that. Did do you that. did do that. Yeah. Good. You if you had skinned him, that would have been a whole different thing. I okay, saved. so you saved you saved the kid. Well, okay, when I say you saved the kid, you turned him into somebody else to take care of. Cool. Anything else? Well, yeah, yeah. I True. saved I saved my skinning knife twice. This is what I love about this game. Because in D and D, you'd be like, "When did we do something bad?" And here we're doing, "When did we do something good?" Yeah. <laughs> Can we count the times? No. Uh, take each of you take a D four for like not leaving him like roadside trash. Oh, yeah. Look, roll like Matt does, and you'll be fine, Yana. Of course, I get that. Nice spirit, Yana. <laughs> See those two paws from the skinning knife thing? They would have been handy right there. Mm. Poor Yana. I, 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 I would, I would suggest Yana that uh, I would. Your character is low enough on sand. I'd probably have a backup character handy, just yeah. saying, you know, because <laughs> she's had a good run. I yeah. like the woman with no name, but for you. For you, it, it might even be good if, like, all of your starting stat points you were to put into to sanity. Uh -huh. Then you'd start with, like, a 99 sand. Mm. And then it would quickly go. <laughs> and then just watch that shit drain away. But you'd have longer with your character. I don't know. It's up to you. Mm. Nice. So, okay. play. Uh, yeah, discard. This is end of mission refill. Discard anything that you do not wish, and then you can refill your hand. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Dog sledding. Ooh. Right. Dog sledding would have been fucking useful at one point. Right. Uh, do you have anything worth keeping in? I have a victory. Oh, sweet. Okay, mm -hmm. keep that shit. 
and I will play one of the two replenishes I have. Hmm. Oh, well, did Yana did Yana do no. a refill thing yet? Because no, 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 no. I need to do a refill. Oh, okay. She's just looking at her one card and going, "I love it so much. <laughs> it's such oh. a good card. We will oh. all be happier for this card." Oh, H is catching up to me. Fortunately, <laughs> it's not here, so you're okay. Cool. I don't. I don't even care what age you are. Here, you feel fine. Cool. And the family card. Does, does the woman with no name actually have any family that have come up in the campaign before? If you don't count the replicant, then no. Actually, I count the replicant. She yeah. is family, so take a D6 for her. I count her. Cool. Very cool. Talk about a lot, and I want, D6 I want I'm waiting for her to roll D6 sand because I know she's going to roll a one. Ah, five. Nice. 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 Damn. Okay, so uh, um, yeah, discard any cards you don't want because Matt's going to give you more okay. cards with his card. Yeah, so mm. fill so yes. so, Okay. Uh, I got. Well, that's good. I got. Uh, Right, magical immunity and nada goes away because I got a slap. Luckily, it wasn't anything worse than that. Mm. So, magical immunity. Uh, right, I've got also, I've just also picked up a discard. So, I will, uh, any cards you wish, and refill your hand. So, I'll play that quickly on my own. Hooray! One second, so, draw four more. Okay. Oh, go. Go, 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 play. Right, dissemination. You guys are definitely cycling through some stuff. Yeah. Right, it's a dissemination. I won't bother with trading cards. Another refill for me. One second. And I've still got another replenish after this. So. Wow. Yeah. Let's get going with the cards. He wants some fucking pies. Yeah. It's switched the top. So far. I have clogging greed. Nice. Nice. Okay. Uh, I've got shit, but I do also. I have also picked up unlimited retrieve. So limit retrieve the dissemination I just played. Wow. Mm. Actually, yeah, no, the best way. I could retrieve the replenish. Yeah. You know what? Well, Screw which it. which one was on top of the deck? No, but I can play the replenish now. Retrieve that, and we both get refills. So that's two more refills each. Ruby. So I'll do it that Ooh. way. So I'll keep the replenish. Um, so draw, draw up to your hand, Yana. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, I like the gambling here. Yeah. 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 Um, that's like, oh, I want amazing greed, please. I will get bored <laughs> like a leopard. Oh my gosh. What? I've got two more limited retrieves. Wow. Right. So the replenish gets picked up again. Well, no, the replenish one you oh, played it. Now. Yeah. Oh, oh you've got another one. Because yeah. each time you play it and then you discard cards, those go on top of it. Oh. No, you play it and you retrieve it straight. If they're both in your hand, I can replenish and then instantly retrieve. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm doing. I'm just discarding a limited retrieve. And then refilling our hands, and when, when they're gone, then I'll just play the last replenish. Go for it. I'm worried that you're going to get a uh, uh, yin yang or some horrible it's shit. What we're, yeah. it's, what we're, it's what we're doing. Right, draw up to your hand, Yana. Mm -hmm. uh, another re roll. Right, so that's all shit for me. Yeah. What did Yana get? So they're, they're I didn't. Cast retrieve. Now wait for Yana to discard her shit off. Yeah. Wine lore. Which one? Wine lore. Oh, wine lore? We use an echo, right? Ha cha. Right. Drop to the hand again, Yana. Okay. Good luck, you two. You're doing some good card play here. Passion. Right. Replenish it. Bloody hell. Not another replenish. Wow. Death God. Death God's fun. Death God and multi kill. 
I shoot everybody. Right. And you got you got nothing left? No. Right, one one of the two flashes I still have. <laughs> Bloody hell. So right. she needs to draw back up? Yep. Yeah. Draw back up. Good time. Going and listen, something else comes out. Now, now you guys are going kind of crazy on it. I like it. Let me see how many cards you've been through. This is not prestigious, is it? Like, yeah. Yeah. Oh, cool. Not yet. Where's all the bloody. Um, uh, been through like 100 and some cards so far. Right. I have got. Um, Yana didn't get anything bad? I was really looking for her to get the fucking yin right. yang or something. No. What's the talk? Uh, what's behind door number two. Oh, now that's, yeah, here's the bad shit coming. I can smell it. Oh, I I have limited retrovir. Oh. So I could pick something up again. Right, nothing, uh, nothing bad. Matt, she's got a limited retrieve. What can she get? Uh, I've still got a, um, so if I play the uh, replen the last replenish I've got. Actually, just transfer it to her hand, and then she can discard her limited retrieve. Mm. Okay. He uh, didn't get anything bad on the what's behind door number two. No. Wow. Cool. Um, That's fucked up. I'm well, so sad in my pants. It's not. Yeah, ten cards. It's not. Yeah, but ten cards is pretty. It's Considering it's all the shit you guys have gone through. It's quite a lot. Usually I have bad cards and I didn't get any bad cards. <laughs> right, here's the replenish. It's amazing okay. how your entire fucking beautiful plan about the mortar all went to shit <laughs> I because know. of the round revision card you discarded. Those cards are like fucking gold, Yana. I would keep those cards like oh it's like I, that or a clogging greed. Yeah, I will rep uh, remember that. <laughs> I'll bet. I'll bet. After that beautiful plan went all this shit. I mean, it was a fucking far out plan. But still. neither of you guys are good at cannon and right. shit. But so we draw up, and then we got one replenishing. Um, yeah. In, uh, so draw, and... drop now. Yeah. Yeah. So you gotta pull some more cards. Guys, kit. Woo. Come to. Right. Nothing. Wow. Wow. I got another well. victory. Oh, nice. Uh -huh. Yeah. Plus, Yana still got one more replenish. If you guys wish to press yeah, your luck. I'm thinking actually, I've got you. Got, so you got two. She's victories. got two victories. I've You're getting one. Oh, wow. Yeah. You guys are up to six I paws see. with Yana at seven. Do you want to risk it all, Yana, or stand pat? I yeah, probably oh, take it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Wait a minute. She's got a victory. You've got a victory. I have that, two victories. Two vic so that's three. Three plus three is six. Yeah, six for Matt, seven for Yana, because yeah. she's got clogging great. Yeah. yeah. Groovy. So uh, now, Matt, I believe that your overflow, what is yeah. that up to? With six, it's now put me on uh, 52. All right. Now, Matt. This this part's going to be good and bad, okay? It's going to suck like a fucking vacuum. All right, so. Hold on a minute. Let me expand this and move this up. Now, uh, let's see. Basically, you get to roll a D10. You don't get to re-roll it. You don't get to spend pause on it. Whatever you get, you're stuck with. Now, at higher levels, like after you've been through different things, then eventually you get to ones that you can spend pause on it, and then after that you'll get to ones you can just pick. But right now it's rolling whatever you get you're fucking stuck with. Right. So um, they're in no particular order. Higher or lower is not necessarily better. Yeah. Good luck, Matty, Matt, Matt. All right. We're all counting on you. It's wherever the one. dice falls. Go ahead for a poopy one. What a poopy one. Six. Okay, you get the poopy one. No, uh, let me look here. Uh, six. Uh, you got the poopy one. Okay, six. I uh, I will also copy paste this into, and you can even see where it says six next to it with slashes around it. That's just for uh, ease of what's it called? Ease of finding which one was number six. I will read it out for the people, as I'm sure they are fucking curious as to 
what it is. Also, do not spend your 50 pause and overflow because your next goal is a 100 pause and overflow. Those stay pat, okay? So what it is is casting time one round, range is 10 meters, duration, concentration, four magic points per round. Basically, you got to win an essence versus essence roll within by, with somebody who's within 10 minutes to disrupt one of their powers, i.e. matrix powers. Actually, I'll write that in. I'm calling these matrix powers just because everybody knows what I'm talking about that way. Um, your choice of which for one round. This is your whole action. Um, so it can... This one can have quite a wide uh, thing. Like if somebody's trying to do something that will fuck you, that is a matrix power, you can stand there and go, I'm doing essence versus essence on you. And you go, eh. so it's not, it's not the most wonderful one in the book, but it's, it's not horrible. Here's what happens. You can spend pause on this. I found out I redid it because it took too long to get a fucking power. Uh, if you spend a pause, then uh, you get a new roll, and to be generous, if you roll uh, the same number, I'll just fucking give you another roll until you don't roll a six. Mm. But all you get is the title, and you have to go off the title. Okay, yeah, that does sound like a it's it's much. potentially a fucking nasty it's, one, it's but bad, it's but mm, I don't know how much it's but... not very much. It'd be the, oh, my God, we need the Now, if it comes up once, I'm going to laugh until I pee myself. Uh, the first time it ever comes up where if you had that power, then it would be fucking awesome. Um, kind of awesome. Hmm. Uh, Tell me your new number and roll until you don't get a six. Okay. Hold on. Roll till you don't get same number again. I'll add that in. Ten. Uh, title on that one is... Uh, psychic hardness. Psychic hardness. <laughs> Interesting. That sounds almost pornographic. I'll have to take that one. You sure? Because uh, once 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 you pick it, you're you're done with it. But uh, to let you know, there are actually I'm going to be more generous. I will read off the titles, but don't spend all don't spend enough pause where you get fucking killed. No, I'll, I'll put uh, the different the different ones are healing, big jump, super dodge, doubler, freeze fade. You've seen that one in action. Uh, disruptor, quick phase, telekinesis, and psychic hardness. You see, psychic hardness actually sounds like it could be pretty good. It's almost like a like a like the old school shield. Mm -hmm. It might be wrong, but it's like psychic hardness. Mm -hmm. Or maybe that's a hard no. Maybe you're strengthening your mind against attack which is rare. actually no this one's not bad i just read through the full thing okay i'll keep, I'll keep it i'll keep it it's it, okay because i mean the healing one obviously would be like oh yeah that's not well it's, but, it's obvious as to what it does yeah yeah but at the same time if we're spending a lot of time in the highlands as well you might really need that much but well if you can find your way back yeah mm -hmm. um okay i will read it as well psychic hardness um this one casting it's a skill so you'd write in skill psychic hardness casting time is instant it by instant you don't spend an action on it and it, it any time that this comes up you just automatically roll it it's like something happens i roll it automatically uh range of self duration is instant any psychic attack or somebody control trying to control your brain in any way if you make your skill you get a willpower times five to resist in addition to whatever normal resistance. Right. Also, if you ever take five points or more uh, sanity loss in a round, then uh, if you make your skill in this, you're immune to fight, flight, or freak. Mm. You still take sand loss, but you don't go crazy for D20 rounds or whatever. Right. And if you ever reach zero sand, you still lose your character. But yeah. you're pretty much, uh, once you get the skill up, well, which the only problem is that unless you've got somebody who can psychically attack you or try to control your brain in some way, magic, psychic, something, getting a check in the skill is hard. Mm -hmm. Unless 
you're doing, unless you get a lot of sanity loss. So if you subject yourself to lots of sanity loss and roll your psychic hardness to not fight, flight, or freak, then you get a check. But it starts to learn like everything. So yeah, it's not bad. It's not horrible. Psychic is hard. Is he hard enough? Oh, I think he is. He's hard. Oh, he's hard, is he? He's so hard. It's nice because it's also like basically free. Yeah. Oh, yeah. This is in addition to anything else. Like, I'm shooting my gun. Me, I psychically controlled. No, no, I'm still shooting gun. Get out of my head. Yeah. <laughs> how many, how many overage pause does uh, Mrs. I'm so crazy? I may have to make a new character soon have. 17. 17 is not bad. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, the 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 um, the special powers for every 50 pause, I try not to make like overly fucking brutally wonderful, although some of them are when you get mm -hmm. into 100, 150 pause. Some of them are pretty fucking good, but they're also kind of depending on where you're at. Like, also, you'll, you'll get to a point where eventually you won't be drawn from that same table. Right, I got three different tables. Oh, shit. Yeah, next time, when you get up to 100, you get a different table, which is once per adventure powers. And then after that, you get up to a different table, which is always on powers. Wow. To be honest, if I'd known that, I might have spent more points. Well, the, no, no, you don't understand. Uh, you're stuck on the table one. All your shit's going to be from table one. Oh, you, you mean because you don't get any more on that? Yeah, I, I no longer give a shit. If you want to spend our pause and stuff, that's well, fine. So, but saying, so next time we draw, it will, we'll there'll, be table, table. there'll be a whole different table. But after you, after you go table one, table two, table three, then when you get up to 200 pause, you're back to table one. Oh, uh, right, okay. You'll good. eventually come back to it. Right, okay. All right. And so I was just wondering, because I was like, yeah, because obviously the healing sounds great, but it's like... Like I'm not gonna you won't you won't see that well looking at it this way it'll be another year in real life before you get back to table one probably at least that. yeah sometimes it just blow I mean the way I do pods I can easily blow enough pods to make sure I get the healing one well let's fucking do it no, why not? so the number you cannot roll again oh. is 10 now oh right so it's not back to now uh, you know what I'm not I'm not gonna do that though. I would try one roll just because that one's such a bitch to build up. Mm. Yeah, I'd probably try one, but that's up to you because you might get like freeze fade, which is okay, but as you've seen, Chris has only used it once. Yeah, that's all right. I did like one. I got this one more try. Two. Two. Big jump. Mm. Um, that that one's actually not, it, it, it's, it's like from the movie The Matrix, basically. Okay. Um, no, this is just gonna be like if you jump off. Yeah. yeah, with a lot of fucking conditional shit. Mm. Oh, what the hell? Oh, you were on there too. That's not a D. No, it's a D. Fucking D hundred. As he spends oh, all his paws to go die, yeah. die, die. Right. What about five? Uh, five is freeze fade. Yeah, I'll take that. All right. That was pretty good, pal. I'm going to copy paste it into the thing for you to uh, do it. For people listening at home, hold on a minute. There's the copy paste and enter. There it is. For people listening at home, here's what freeze fade does. Be sure to keep good uh, thing on this. Uh, two rounds. One is holding still, and then next round, uh, casting the spell. Range is self. Uh, it's until you move, max of an hour. Magic point cost is only two. If you can't build this one up, you're doing it wrong. Um, you're invisible if you're holding completely still to background folk. If there's any agents around, they automatically spot you as an anomaly and try to kill you. Zero sand for doing. No sand loss for any PCs as this only works on background folk, not Dora's. Um, moving at all requires a different skill roll, more magic points, makes you invisible to cameras unless an agent um, is monitoring the feed. If people are firing at you and fade out while standing still, then they're negative to hit on their next attack. Should they uh, take one, they will, and you get hit, 
probably. And you're considered to have moved and you're visible again. Uh, this is useless to do under direct observation by background folk. And there's an air power that it can connect in with. So and some of the powers, like if you get uh, the one called Ghost in the Machine as well, which is a future table, then uh, it you, it gets a more complicated and powerful spin. Mm -hmm. No, that's, um, that's quite handy. It's not bad. It's not bad. Uh, I mean, you know, all of, them, all of them are handy in different times and places and shit. But yeah, yeah. Uh, being considering background folk are most of what you've met. Yeah. I mean, yeah, uh, you got to be completely still. But that's the kind of thing that. Uh, I would I would just fucking build it up like a fucking fiend. Oh yeah. Like daily. You guys have got so many daily things that you're doing, it's amazing. Oh, yeah. Also, these these powers, unlike the spell things, if you get a crit, it doesn't matter as far as you know getting new yeah. shit. Okay. Just roll some... All right, well you guys do the scopes, I'm gonna end the recording and Bye-bye, everybody. Time to say something classy. Uh, <laughs> Always classy. Be careful about your skinning knives. They are very, very gentle and delicate and are easily hurt. Oh. <laughs> Important safety announcement there, folks. Yes. Take care. <laughs>